Hi guys, welcome back to my XPS guide. Now I'm gonna guide you on this, the true Garuda event. So let's begin, okay? This battle, I think this is not that hard because in my opinion, if you have played the game since last year, then you probably have faced Titan from Final Fantasy XIV. And I think that one, it's much, much harder. Okay, so let's start. I think I need Orlando here because I'm using Agrias. So let's check, yep. He equipped Excalibur, pretty good it seems, but Crush Weapon, yep, this is perfect Orlando, so let's begin, okay? Mm, Jin, and let's begin, let's begin. I will talk about equipment later after I beat this Garuda, okay? So, yep, come on, hurry up, yep. There's no escape, no hope, none. Okay, so, on the first turn, you can start tanking because I have Orlando okay but if you don't have Orlando make sure you break its attack and magic using your warrior of flight or whoever else okay and make sure you don't attack the monolith okay you don't want to attack that monolith crush weapon and let's focus on defense first okay war gunnet I will use prayer to Eidolon because yeah she got nothing to do. And Agrias, I will simply use normal attack because remember Agrias doesn't have any authority press. Then you don't want to waste her MP, okay. Okay, see? The damage is nothing dangerous, I think. Only 200. Um, on the second turn, I will use Breath Presence. This will guarantee Garuda's magic attack also hit Warrior of Light. And that's good for Warrior of Light because he will counter it using MP Restore. And for Garnet, I think I'm gonna use... Um, I think she doesn't need to do anything, but... Yeah, let's just... No, 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 no. Yeah, let's just use Kyuraga, okay? I don't think you need... And for Soleil, let's buff attack and magic. Okay, spirit maybe not that important, maybe, okay, but maybe if you died, then you should prioritize your defense first, instead of attack and magic. Tap tap. Okay, nice 15% per turn. Okay. Yep, nice warrior of light. This time, mm, let's buff our defense and spirit. Okay, on this battle, really guys, you really need to reduce its health below 50% very fast because yeah, sometimes this Garuda can attack this monolith and yeah, if this monolith damage, then her threshold attack gonna be much much powerful. But if the Garuda never attack the monolith, then his her threshold attack is joke. Okay, so. Let's pray to Eidolon again. And yeah, you don't want to use any summoning because that will damage the monolith unless you use um, Leviathan. But if you use Behemoth, be careful. Okay, so... Um, I think I'm gonna use... Yeah, simply defend, I think. Save your MP, I got no MP battery. Okay, nice. Weak wheel, friction. See? Nothing dangerous. Mm, let's pop our attack and magic again. Okay, and then Garnet. Garnet, I think I'm gonna simply use Kiraga, okay. And I think I think I'm I'm gonna use arms eraser because yeah yeah maybe on this turn it's gonna recover from its break attack so remember to refresh it okay so tap tap below fifty percent please no don't burst see 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 it attack the monolith okay this mean 
her threshold attack gonna be much powerful, okay? So on the previous battle, her threshold attack only deal about 500 damage to me and what a joke I think. But I'm not sure how much damage it's gonna do to me right now, okay? So let's prepare by buffing our defense and spirit. Okay, and let's use Kyuraga here. Okay, Warrior of Like. Let's use Like is with us. Okay, and Divine Renation. Divine Renation. Tap tap. Okay, so yeah, you cannot lower each. Oh, still only 400 damage. Okay, so I think when hit one or twice, maybe don't make a big deal. Okay, okay, not that hard, I think. Now you need to prepare against the Suparna or Chirada or whatever. Okay, because I got no, mm, I got no MP battery, so I will drain MP now to reveal my MP. Okay. Okay, nice. Mm. Let's use Kiraga now. Mm. Mm -hmm. attack and magic. Covered ally. So I'm gonna use. I think Breath Presence is the right choice. Die, die, die. Yep, they... Okay, so that's a safe turn. So now you want to kill this Suparna, okay, as fast as possible. This man, I'm gonna summon Bahamut and chain, okay. I believe I will kill it. Or maybe if you are confident with your attack power, you can immediately go to go straight to Garuda, but I'm gonna defeat it slowly. And for Warrior of Light, what should you shoot? Okay, I'm gonna... Yeah, to be safe, I'm gonna use Arm Eraser, okay? Okay, Arm Eraser. And let's dance to... Okay, and... Tap. Now let's hope I change this correctly, okay? Yep, Suparna dead. Nice, okay. But it's not over, okay. It still can be quite dangerous. No? This Chirada only yeah, restore Garuda's health, so maybe it won't pose you much threat, okay. So Divine Renation, Soleil, mm, I think, yeah, this one. Reduce defense. Let's check Warrior of Luck buff. Luck is with us is gone, so let's cast Luck is with us. And yeah, okay, Warrior of Luck MP is running out soon, so let's defeat this as fast as possible. Mm, I'm gonna use... Mm, wait, wait, let's check. Yeah, just pray to Eidolon to defeat... Garuda faster. Yep, dead in one turn. Okay. Okay, yep, yep, yep. Nice, nice. Okay, so now only Garuda left. I don't think she gonna pose much threat. Okay. So let's use Kyuraga. Kyuraga, Warrior of Light. Let's check his buff, covers ally. So I'm gonna use Lance. I'm hoping I will restore some MP. Okay, nice 55, not bad. Mm, let's buff our defense and spirit. And Divine Nation. Divine Nation. Tap tap. Okay. Slipstream. Please attack Warrior of Light with magic attack. I need his MP to be recovered. Okay. So let's use this one, right? Wait, wait, wait. 
Yeah, yeah. Okay, let's do Bahamut Salmon again. Defire Renation. No, 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 no. Makeup Layer. So. Okay, so I'm gonna use. Let's break its attack and magic just in case I don't kill this Garuda on this turn. Okay, tap. Okay, so I believe I will kill it on the next turn. Yep. Yep, we did it. Okay, we will win on this turn. Bye bye, Garuda. You are much, much easier compared to Titan. Okay. I think maybe Gummy become really afraid on releasing hard, hard content. Okay. But it's okay because it will be encourage new players to play this game. Okay. My power, no. Okay, enough. Okay. I will talk about equipment. Okay, so for today, maybe I want to release a video about about Dragon Quest, maybe tomorrow I will talk about shopping guide in more detailed version, okay? Mm -hmm. Because this farming has a rig swatch, so I need to calculate about whether it is worth or not, okay? And where's my equipment? Let's talk about equipment, okay? Really important here. Mm, so first, why I use Tetra Sylphid on Angrias? Very easy, the answer is Bird Killer. Tetra Sylphid, 2 stars, okay? 2 stars Tetra Sylphid has Bird Killer. So, yep, Bird Killer is really useful. That's why I equip Angrias with Tetra Sylphid. And for, for Warrior of Light, I don't... Yeah, I use this, okay? Zan, uh, I, equip, I equip Warrior of Light with... With Odin because maybe if I'm if I cannot kill Suparna on the first turn and if Suparna buff the Garuda I can tell Warrior of Light to dispel using finger snap. That's the reason I use Odin on Warrior of Light. Also it gives him Lance and like you can see Lance is very good on this battle, okay. But if you have Ramza or Lunera, then you don't need that lens, okay. For Garnet, let's check her equipment. I equip her using Luxmi, but you don't need, okay. If you have all, if all your characters have paralyzed resist, then you don't have Lux. You don't need to equip Luxmi, okay. So like you can see here, my Garnet equipped Jewel Ring because paralyzed resistance is really important on this battle. So this Evo Magic plus 10%, so really guys, nothing special. Maybe this Holy One is kind of special because I know that Shiratan is much, much harder than this. But really, you don't need Holy One like you can see before that. I rarely use any Dual Cast Kyuraga, okay? So yeah, really, Holy One is not that needed, okay? So Elf of Goddess is free. And for this, Agrias Murasame Plus is from the White Dragon. Yep, yep, Fury Ring, you can buy Fury Ring. Very cheap, okay, only 200 star quartz, and I believe you must buy it, okay, this is very good accessory, I just buy it today, okay, so this, 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 okay, Warrior of Light, again, nothing special, on previous battle, I used Genji Shield, and I still win, without any difficulty, so I think this Zodiac Escachion is nothing special, why I use Assassin Fast, because Assassin Fast, has paralyzed resist. Remember, paralyzed resist. It is really important. This one, really, nothing special. Okay, so for Soleil, you can throw this with anything, because yeah, basically you only need hit. You only need her to dance. Okay, so yep, that's all I think. I believe you can defeat Garuda. Okay, if you have any difficulties, simply leave comment and I will try to help you. Okay, what important is. Yeah, you able to chain correctly. That's why I use Agrias instead of my Onion Knight because, yeah, I know Onion Knight is much more, more powerful than Agrias, but I cannot chain him properly. So, yeah, Agrias is MVP. So, yep, I think that's all you need to know about this two Garuda event. Thank you very much for watching. Please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more Final Fantasy Brave X Views Guide.
Bye-bye, guys.